Hello everybody, it's me. Just a real quick video. Um, I wouldn't normally share something like this because it's a very personal thing, um, but I feel this is important because everybody, every woman out there should have access to contraception or birth control regardless of age, if that's a decision she wants to make, you know, any person, um, because I know there are people who identify as other, um, who wants to be sexually active, um, should have access to birth control affordably and they shouldn't be stopped because it's a right, at least to me it is. So anyway, I'm going to be unbagging my The Pill Club delivery and what The Pill Club is, is a company that sends out birth control and a couple goodies, um, to the people who subscribe to their service. And what's nice is they don't auto send stuff out, like, um... Once your three months is up, if you want to continue, they'll email you and you choose to be charged again. Um, there is a $15 fee, uh, $15 doctor's fee, and then whatever your cost of your birth control is ends up depending on the whether or not you have insurance, uh, generic versus brand name, and... Uh, the price also depends on how many you get sent out at one time. For me, um, the three, even though I haven't tried this before, um, this particular type, uh, was only, it was cheaper to get three months as opposed to one month or 12. But they can actually, um, as long as you're approved, and if, you know, if you know what you're going to get and then you ask them to prescribe that to you, you can get a whole month sent to you, or a whole year sent to you. So, that's not bad. This was only 27 to $30 for three months, which is extremely cheap. So, and I didn't have to go through a doctor. So the first things I'm going to pull out here is some general, it's upside down, huh? some general drug information that they print out for you, a, pa a pamphlet on whether or not you got, you know, if you were expecting um, what one product and it looks different it's probably it's possibly or probably because it's generic they send out a pharmacy essentials pamphlet which basically reviews what the pill club does um and has you know frequency ask questions patient frequently asked questions patient rights and responsibilities and stuff like that And let us get into the bag itself. Um, my personal uh, choice of medication is nobody's business, so I'm just going to cover that up. But here is the actual birth control. I have three months in here, so there's two more packs that came with it. Those are, you can hear them in the background. And then they also send you little tweets because yay birth control fun so the first thing unfortunately because it's in a mailer my candy cane got broke but i guess for december they're sending out little miniature candy canes and then there is a little bit of chocolate mocha chino chocolate milk chocolate with espresso so that and then they sent out a sticker with your order and then this one says, the snuggle is real. I love this. I think this is so cute because it's, it's like my sweetie and me and a baby. So um, I think it's great. It's a nice little, you know, it's a nice little service for people. You can also order to have female emergency contraception or plan B or whatever it is called whatever brand it is. Uh, you can also order that to, you can also order that to be included in your order. I think it's only about $15 a pill, which is far cheaper than getting it at the store for $50. Um, remember if you are plus size or, you know, overweight, including up to obese, you may want to order additional ones of those because it has been proven that it is not effective past a certain weight point to only take one. And they also, if you want to purchase them, you they also sell female condoms. And 
occasionally regular ones are included in your mailer as well. So I think it's a great service. I think the pricing is reasonable and I think it would be really good for people who don't have access, regular access to a doctor, who don't have money for co-pays or just to be honest, younger women whose parents do not approve of them taking birth control or families with religious restrictions that somebody doesn't want to be held under. I'm babbling. <laughs> so anyway, great idea. Glad I got it. And I'll see you guys next time.